Hey everybody, Winstreak here. Today's video we're going to go through and show you how to upload your game onto itch.io as an HTML5. So you're going to start out by loading up your project and then you can just minimize your project here. You just care about the overall file and you're going to right click that, grab export and we will hop into HTML5. As far as I understand, these two extra settings here are going to increase the export time but make your quality better from the recommendations I've heard. It is better to do these whenever you're going live with a game. Since my video is just to show you guys how to get through this, I'm going to save the time that we can by ignoring those. And I'm just going to go ahead and export it as is. And it's done already. So we will open up the file with our zip. Move that to the side for later. And we'll hop over to our itch.io account. And we will go into our dashboard. So this is where we will add our projects and click new project. And I'll just throw a random name down, and that title is going to move down to your projected URL. And this will just be how you can search for your game. You can throw whatever description you want. Free game. Whatever classification it falls under. It's an HTML game for me. I am in a very early prototype. So we have three options here. We can force them to never give us any money. Uh, we can request they give us no money and we can set a suggested if they want to pay us and then require them to pay us money with paid so i'm going to do the zero or donate with a suggestion of zero now we're going to upload files and hop into my quick access and dungeon crawl one and you just put the whole zip file in there and then you can move on uh my game will be able to automatically start on load since it's html it won't be a big deal. Full screen is fine and I don't like enabling scroll bars and my game is not mobile friendly so I'll skip those. I have no special details to add. Uh, here you can select your game genre so I'm just going to put action down here and then tags you can throw in as many different tags that you think your game falls under. So mine's an action dungeon crawler. Uh, any custom noun you want to replace the word game with you can put in here. I will leave mine as is. Any special download and install instructions which I don't have any. And then the community, I want people to be able to comment at the bottom. I need to save this before I can switch this to public. So I'm going to save and view page. And it tells me it's loading the game for the first time. And you can see up here we are in a draft still. And I can maximize this. And if I click on it, I can run around and play my game just as I could in Construct. But now other people can play it as well. And everything works. So I like it. And now I will hop back into edit game and move this to public and save. Uh, additionally up here we have a image cover. So you can throw in a image for people to see when they go to play your game. And I'll throw in a subscribe button there. <coughs> cough cough. And we will also check out screenshots which you can just throw in different screenshots that people will see. You probably want them of your game instead of, of American Dad but that's just what I got. And go ahead and save that. And now if I go back to my home page and my dashboard, you can see here that the subscribe button is now in place. And then if we hop on over to the search and type in our game name, we can find it here under the name Game Time, which I named it. And if I highlight it, it shows us those additional images we put up for our game. So that is where you would want to upload different points you want to show off in your game. So when people highlight, they will get a good idea what your game's going to be. Alright, hopefully you guys find that helpful. Let me know in the comments, and have a good one.